Hey, what's going on everybody? Sean here. Welcome back to the channel. This video is the continuation of my nine day stay here in Texas. As you can see, I have my Angels jersey on, which means only one thing. Angels versus Rangers. I was here last year when the Angels came to town and I'm here again this year. So, me and my sister are going to the game, sitting in the outfield, in the all-you-can-eat seats, located in left field, just underneath where we were sitting last year. But anyway, we're getting ready to hit the road, a couple stops along the way, and uh, we'll be hitting the stadium. So, this is the Angels versus the Texas Rangers. They lost the first game of the three-game series last night by a very unfortunate 12-0 final. Uh, we'll see how it goes today. So, maybe I can bring some luck. I don't know. I don't have good luck when I see the uh, Angels at stadiums. So, anyway, but we'll see. So, come along for the ride. Angels versus the Rangers. And we're in the car. <laughs> One of the stops that we made was to Dutch Bros Coffee. It's a relatively new coffee place that hasn't been around for that long. We're both trying it for the first time. Presley got herself an iced white mocha and I got their um, blue raspberry frost, cotton candy frost, excuse me which is made with ice cream, blue raspberry, white chocolate, and whipped cream. And we got their large, which is huge. It's almost the exact same size as my head. It's a big freaking thing of ice cream. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're in the car on the way to Arlington to see this ball game. So... Anyway, I'm just rolling along through traffic. Oh, well, we parked. And we have to walk a little bit to the stadium. <laughs> but to get there, we are walking past the former home of the Texas Rangers, Globe Life, uh, Globe Life Park, now known as Choctaw Stadium. Just a little bit of a walk to get uh, <laughs> to get over to the stadium from where we had to park. So uh, anyway, there it is. Uh, here we go. We have found our. We have found our entrance to the all-you-can-eat seats. The game has already started and we're still making our way to the seats. Here we go. Hudger. Something just happened. Strikeout. Okay. Well, here we go. Angels went... Uh, Scoreless. First pitch from Lucas Giolito is a called strike. in the blowout 12 nothing victory. Trust in you. You better catch Otani's home run. <laughs> Get him, Lucas, come on. Got him. Oh! Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo. Three 
two pitch. Struck him out swinging. Bottom of the second inning. One out. Mitch Garver, second base after a one out double. Batting second in the center fielder, number 50. Swing and a miss. Full count. If he'd have made contact with that one, I think he would have deposited it about halfway up the seats. <laughs> Here comes the 3-2 pitch. Ball four in the dirt. There he is. <laughs> some WWE chants, not not baseball. <laughs> Unless it's Jose Altuve. Oh, fair ball, the race to the back. He was out that Come on, Shohei! <laughs> Come on, tie the game, Show! You know you can do it! No, he did not go. Come on. We want a Tommy. We want a Tommy. We want a Tommy. Come on. Come on, Shohei. Pitcher in the ball game for the Rangers. New pitcher for the Rangers is number 66, Josh Spores. Leading off the top of the seventh inning is going to be Eduardo Escobar. Current score is four to one, Texas. I'm <laughs> 
Coming in to pitch for the Angels, Aaron Luke. Replacing Lucas Giglio. to one Texas. Well, I think the, the Angels are officially screwed because now coming into pitch is our oldest Chapman. The man throws heat. And, uh... Yeah, so our oldest Chapman one of the fastest pitchers in Major League Baseball. So. Uh. Luis Ranjifo is leading off against Chapman. First pitch was 98 miles an hour. That was an 88 mile an hour slider. comes the 0-2. It is going to be 101. There's a chance. There's a chance. 101 mile an hour sinker. Here it comes. Another 101 sinker. the gun again. not be scared for your life like that 101 ground ball to the shortstop Now down seven to one. A little 
little scoreboard update. It is seven to three after Randall Gritchick hit a two-run home run in the top of the ninth inning. Landed right over here in the Angels bullpen. Now it's one out with Eduardo Escobar at bat. And that's just outside for a ball. Angels are down to their final strike. Ground ball, shortstop. Over to first. Rangers take the victory. It's a couple days later after the ball game. Uh, just haven't filmed the outro because I'm dumb. But anyway, um, after the game on Tuesday night, um, because we were sitting right next to the Angels bullpen, I walked over to the gate to the fence, and there's a guy that I know that uh, works with the Angels. He's one of the bullpen coaches. Um, he catches the pitchers when they're warming up. Uh, I've been talking to him since last season. Um, and usually when I talk to him, he'll hook me up with the ball. So, um, it's cool to see him every so often at the end of the game, the angels closer, Carlos Estevez, uh, he was walking out of the bullpen with most of the pitchers and he had a baseball in his hand. I was like, Carlos can you toss the ball up. So he tossed the ball to me, gave that one to my sister because she's never gotten a major league baseball. And I have a few in my collection. Um, he saw me and he's like, Hey, how you doing? I'm like, eh. Could be better, even though the Angels lost. Um, but here's a little, here's a little thing that I had with him. So last year, I had started asking him if I could have the lineup card that they keep in the duck in the bullpen. And he was telling me he said, "No, I, I can't give it to you because um, people will go and sell them online." So I asked him again last night. I'm like still any chance for the lineup card and he looked at me and he gave me that look like eh, I don't know um, and then I guess he had a change of heart because the guy looked he looked up at me and he's like you know what this guy came all the way from California to see the uh, to see the team play um, take it and so I looked down at him I'm like are you serious and he's like yeah go ahead I'm like, dude, thank you. This means a lot. So, I have the official, well, not official, but I have a version of the lineup card from the Angels bullpen from Tuesday night. You can see all the different marks that were made on there. Um, where the Angels pinch hit two players and then they put the markings on there for the Rangers. But still pretty cool because now I can add that to my collection. So, anyway. Thanks for watching this video of the Angels and the Rangers. One of the first vlogs that I ever put on the channel was me and my dad in 2018 going and seeing the Angels play the Rangers. Um, the night that Albert Pujols got his 3,000 hit ceremony. Um, and we got that bobblehead. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, like, comment if you want to. Subscribe if you're interested. Um, and stay tuned because there may be a couple more Texas videos. We'll find out. Anyway, see you guys. Mm -hmm.